A retired police officer in Radcliffe, Kentucky, who was arrested on rape and sodomy charges, died in jail this morning. 69-year-old David Love was under investigation. The citation states that Love was allegedly having a sexual relationship with a minor. Love admitted to receiving sexual acts from that minor. Love also admitted he was in possession of child pornography. The Hardin County coroner says Love passed away in the hospital this morning. The police, sworn to protect and serve, but what happens when those sworn to uphold the law become the lawbreakers? It's a terrifying reality that has plagued communities for far too long. Across America, individuals with questionable qualifications and even more questionable morals have infiltrated police departments. These are not just a few bad apples. These are individuals who exploit their power, operating above the law they are meant to enforce. These officers engage in behavior ranging from petty theft and corruption to excessive force and even murder. They operate with impunity, shielded by a culture of silence known as the Blue Wall. This unwritten code demands loyalty to fellow officers, even at the expense of justice. It discourages whistleblowers and protects those who abuse their power. The result? A system where bad cops flourish and communities suffer. This is not an attack on all police officers. There are countless brave and honorable men and women who wear the badge with integrity. They put their lives on the line every day to keep our communities safe. But the actions of the corrupt few tarnish the reputation of the many. They erode public trust and make it harder for good officers to do their jobs. We must break down the blue wall of silence and hold all officers accountable for their actions.